ഹായ് ഹലോ എവറിബഡി ദിസ് ഇസ് യുവർ ശ്രീനിവാസ് വെൽക്കം ടു ശ്രീനിവാസ അക്കാഡമി മൈ ഡിയർ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ദോസ് വർ വാച്ചിങ് ഫസ്റ്റ് ടൈം മൈ യൂട്യൂബ് ചാനൽ പ്ലീസ് ഡു സബ്സ്ക്രൈബ് ലൈക്ക് ആൻഡ് ഷെയർ ആൾസോ സോ ദാറ്റ് യു വിൽ ഗെറ്റ് നോട്ടിഫിക്കേഷൻസ് വെൻ എവർ ന്യൂ വീഡിയോ ആഡഡ് മൈ ഡിയർ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് നേരെ മീക്ക് മുന്ദുകാനേ പ്രാമിസ് ചെയ്യുന്നതിനെ എവ്രി ഡേ ഒക്ക ടാപിക് തോ ഒക്ക അത്ഭുതമേന ടെക്നിക് തോ മീ മുന്ദു കോസ്തനം ചപ്പണം ജരിഗിന്ദി അതേ വിധങ്ങ ഈരോസ് കൂടാ ബൈനോമിയൽ തീരം almost all two questions we can expect from this topic ബൈനോമിയൽ തീരം കി സംബന്ധിച്ചി കൊന്നി മോഡൽസ് ഷോർട്ട് കട്ട് ലോ എലാ ചെയ്യാലി അനി എക്സ്പ്ലെയിൻ ചെടാൻ കി മീ മുന്ദുക രാവടൻ ജരിഗിന്ദി Dear friends every day morning 6 o'clock mana channel nundi oka kotta video release avutundi so please do watch okay let's go to the topic in binomial theorem first let's discuss a point x plus a whole to the power n expansion in this general term general term T R plus 1 is equals to N C R X to the power N minus R A power R. If it is X minus A whole to the power N, general term will be T R plus 1 that is minus 1 power R N C R X power R. This can also be written as x plus of minus a whole to the power of n that's why tr plus 1 can also be written as ncr x power n minus r x power n minus r a power r here x power n minus r minus a whole power r also we can write okay so to observe that questions in this question number 1 the coefficient of x power 8 in the expansion 3x square plus 5 by x cube whole to the power 9 okay for this there will be a formula but instead of remembering that formula better to use the general term okay general term in this expansion will be tr plus 1 is equals to 9c or 3x square whole to the power 9 minus r 5 by x cube whole to the power r this is 9c r 3 power 9 minus r 5 power r x to the power 18 minus 2 r minus 3 r 18 minus 5 r but question is to find coefficient of x power 8 in order to get coefficient of x power 8 put 18 minus 5r is equals to 8 so that 5r is equals to 10 r is equals to 2 whenever r is equals to 2 we get coefficient of x power 8 which is 9c2 into 3 to the power 9 minus 2 is 7 into 5 square 9c2 3 power 7 into 5 square can be seen in first option do observe that what we have done just with the help of general term actually there will be a formula a x power p plus b by x power q whole to the power of n instead of remembering that this will be very very easy okay next in the expansion of 2x plus y plus 3z whole to the power 10 the coefficient of x square y power 5 z cube is first i will write the general term in a multinomial expansion suppose ax plus by plus cz whole to the power n general term will be n factorial by ax whole to the power p by whole to the power sorry 
n factorial by p factorial q factorial r factorial ax whole power p by whole power q cz whole power r such that p plus q plus r is equals to n this is the concept we are going to use okay according to this given expansion is 2x plus 3y plus sorry 2x plus y plus 3z whole to the power 10 okay general term will be 10 factorial by p factorial q factorial r factorial 2x whole to the power p y power q 3z whole to the power r where p plus q plus r is equals to 10 do observe that in order to get x square y power 5 z cube to get x square replacing p by 2 to get y power 5 q value 5 to get z power 3 r value 3 put p is equals to 2 q is equals to 5 r is equals to 3 general term will be 10 factorial by 2 factorial 5 factorial 3 factorial this will be 2 square into 1 into 3 power 3 into x square y cube sorry y power 5 z cube so coefficient will be this one so 10 factorial by 2 factorial 5 factorial 3 factorial 4 into 27 is 108 can be seen in first option only coefficient means beside of that term whichever the numerical value beside of that variable term okay so that can be seen in option one only dead easy in case of multinomial expansion also next problem number three the term independent of x in the expansion 2x power 1 by 2 minus 3x power minus 1 by 3 whole to the power 20 term independent of x means it is free from x independent of x independent of x is nothing but free from free from x or this is only called constant without variable okay do observe that given expansion is 2x power 1 by 2 minus 3x power minus 1 by 3 whole to the power 20 whole to the power 20 in this tr plus 1 will be 20 cr 2x power 1 by 2 whole power 20 minus r minus 3x power minus 1 by 3 whole to the power r which is 20 cr 2 to the power 20 minus r minus 3 to the power r x power 10 minus r by 2 minus r by 3 10 minus r by 2 minus r by 3 okay so this is the general term in order to get free from x term when we say that this is free from x term when x term is absent x term is absent only when numerator 10 minus r by 2 minus r by 3 is equals to 0 10 is equals to 5r by 6 2 r is equals to 12 replacing r is equals to 12 we get independent term which is 20 c 12 2 power 8 20 minus 12 
minus 3 whole power 12 is plus only 3 power 12 can be seen in first option here also just we have used general term almost all we should avoid the formula even to find independent term also there is a formula but I am not going to use any of the formula just general term however you will remember it is mandatory also so that's why with the general term only we are calculating values next the number of integral terms in the expansion of the number of integral terms in the expansion of c square root 3 plus 8th root 5 whole to the power 256 can also be written as 3 to the power 1 by 2 5 to the power 1 by 8 whole to the power 256 here also tr plus 1 is equals to 256 cr 3 power 1 by 2 whole to the power 256 minus r 5 power 1 by 8 whole power r which is 256 cr 3 to the power uh, 256 minus r by 2 5 to the power r by 8 see this is integral term or rational term only when it is free from radical powers radical powers means fractional powers so whenever 3 is free from fractional power it is called an integer 5 is also free from radical powers it is called rational term or integral term in order to eliminate fractions we have because of n value is 256 r is varying from 0 to 256 whichever the values first of all r by 8 r by 8 is free from fraction only when r is multiple of 8 either 0 or multiple of 8 for multiples of 8 you check whether it is free from fractions or not however 256 is even number any even number is subtracted from 256 again it is even even number by 2 is always cancelled that's why it is enough to take our values 0 8 16 so on 256 256 is also factor multiple of 8 8 3 is a 24 8 2 is a 56 in order to count these numbers these numbers 8 1s 8 2s this is 8 32s till here there are 32 terms plus one more term is there total number of terms number of integral terms integral terms 33 number of integral terms 33 first option this can also be written as answer answer 256 by LCM of 2 comma 8 LCM of 2 comma 8 integral part plus 1 is shortcut method shortcut method is integral part of 256 by denominator LCM of 2 comma 8 plus 1 so LCM of 2 comma 8 is 8 plus 1 after the cancellation we get 32 here so 32 integral part is 32 itself plus 1 33 so this is the shortcut to find number of integral terms or number of rational terms simple 
here nothing is there means 2 is there 2 comma 8 LCM 8 256 is given n value so 256 by LCM plus 1 next if the coefficient of fifth sixth seventh terms are in AP then n is equals to very very important result this is fifth sixth terms of 1 plus x whole power n or in AP let us discuss rth r plus 1th r plus 2th terms of 1 plus x whole power n r in AP coefficients of I am not talking about terms coefficients of rth term r plus 1th term r plus 2th terms of this expansion r in AP then the condition n square minus of 4r plus 1 into n plus 4r square minus 2 is equals to 0. If you don't want to remember this formula, if you use this formula, we get r value 5, n value we don't know, 4 into 5, 20, 21 n, 4 into 25, 100, 98 is equals to 0, n minus 7 into n minus 14 is equals to 0, n is equals to 7 or 14, n is equals to 7 or 14, 7 is not there in options, 14 is there, that's why answer is that, when you remember this formula, otherwise, otherwise, T, r plus 1 is equals to ncr x power r fifth term in order to get 5 put r is equals to 4 ncr x power 4 t6 nc5 x power 5 t7 nc6 x power 6 given that this 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 or in AP, whenever they are in AP, 2 times NC5 is equals to NC4 plus NC8. 2 is equals to NC4 by NC5 plus NC6, sorry, NC6 by NC5. Here, NCR by NCR minus 1 will be N minus R plus 1 by R. If you want, you can simplify here also. 2 is equals to, this is in reverse order, 5 by n minus 5 plus 1 plus n minus 6 plus 1 by 6. Okay. After the simplification of this, we get n square minus 21 n plus 98 is equals to 0. So, from this we can solve for n that is n is equals to 7 or 14 so for such problems better to remember the result so this is the working rule okay next larger of 99 power 50 plus 100 power 50 and 101 power 50 so which of these two is greater larger of these two do observe that when we say that when we say that x is greater than y if x minus y is greater than 0 when we say that x is less than y if x minus y less than 0 when we say that x is equals to y when x minus y is equals to 0 okay in order to decide which of these two is greater better to consider either this minus this or this minus this okay see consider consider 101 power 50 minus of 99 power 50 plus 100 power 50 this is 
100 plus 1 whole power 50 100 minus 1 whole power 50 minus 100 power 50 here first term first term gets cancelled two times of second term third term third term gets cancelled two times of fourth term we get like that two times two times of second term that will be 50 c1 100 power 49 next 50 c3 100 power 47 next 50 c5 100 power 45 plus and so on at last 50 c49 100 minus 100 power 50 okay this is 50 c1 is 50 2 into 50 100 100 into 100 power 49 100 power 50 plus 2 times of 50 c3 100 power 47 plus and so on 50 c49 100 minus 100 power 50 gets cancelled what did you observe now whichever the value that is positive so this term minus this term is positive means which is greater in these two first one is greater therefore 101 power 50 is greater than 99 power 50 plus 100 power 50 so this is greater in these two usually we thought that this is looking like larger in length but this is greater very simple okay next c0 plus c1 by 2 plus c2 by 2 square plus c3 by 2 cube plus cn by 2 power n is equals to do observe that n c r is denoted by c r don't confuse and n c 1 is equals to n n c 2 is equals to n into n minus 1 by 2 n c 3 is equals to n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 by 3 into 2 into 1 etc so n c r will be n c r will be n 2 below n 2 below R products n2 below R products by R2 below R products n2 below R products by R2 below R products just like 10c4 can be written as in the numerator 10 to below 4 products in the denominator 4 to below 4 products. So that is the way to write NCR value. Okay. Do observe that. Here C0. Don't confuse that. C0 stands for NC0. C1 by 2 plus C2 by 2 square. C3 by 2 cube plus and so on Cn by 2 power n. Here there is a result. But we don't want to use any result. Just let's go by substitution. Whichever you like, put n is equals to 1. Put n is equals to 1. Whenever n is equals to 1, question stops at last term will be c1 by 2 power 1. Wherever you get c1 by 2 power 1, question stops there only. Okay. Now the question changes to c0 plus c1 by 2 c0 stands for 1 c0 c1 is 1 c1 by 2 1 c0 is 1 1 c1 is 1 by 2 which is 3 by 2 put same n is equals to 1 in options check where you are getting 3 by 2 while writing n is equals to 1 in options put n is equals to 1 in options first option 
थ्री बै टू सैकंड आपशन टू बै थ्री थर्ड आपशन फै बै थ्री फोर्थ आपशन थ्री बै फाइव सो फस्ट आपशन इज आसर वेरी सिंपल नो नीड टू यूज ए नी रिसलट नो नीड टू यूज ए नी रिसलट डोंट कंफ्यूज दैट सी थ्री स्टैंड फर एन सी थ्री वि हेव चेंजड द क्वेश्चन बै टेकिंग एन इज ईक्वल टू वन इट इज नाट मैंडेटरी यू कैन टेक एन वैल्यू विच एवर यू लाइक विच एवर यू लाइक यू कैन आलो टेक एन वैल्यू टू देन क्वेश्चन स्टॉप सेट C2 by 2 square, wherever you get C2 by 2 square, question till that term. So first three terms we have to evaluate. In options also we have to write n is equals to two. Tell me what you are going to get while writing n is equals to two. Three by two whole square, nine by four you are going to get there. Because answer is first option. Okay, let's move on to next question. C1 by C0 plus 2 into C2 by C1 plus 3 into C3 by C2 plus and so on n into Cn by Cn minus 1. Here also we don't want to use any of the result. Put n is equal to anything, whichever you like. Suppose let us take this time n is equal to 2. Already we have used n is equal to 1 in first question. Now question changes to You have to see the last term by writing n is equal to two. Last term becomes two into c two by c one. Wherever you are getting two into c two by c one, question stops there. That's why c one by c not plus two into c two by c one. According to our assumption, c one stands for n c one. Here n c one is two c one by two c not. 2 into c2 is 2c2 denominator 2c1 so 2c1 is 2 by 2c0 is 1 2 into 2c2 is 1 by 2 2 to gets cancelled answer is 3 but not there in three in options why because we have changed the question you have to change options also put n is equals to 2 in options okay First option, n value two, two into three by two, two into three by two, three. Yes, you are getting in first option only. Second option, two into one by two, one. This is not our answer. Third option, two minus one, one into three by two. This is not our answer. Fourth option, two into 2 plus 2, 4 by 2, 4. This is not our answer. So answer is first option. Okay, very simple. Without using any of the result, just by substitution, we can decide the answer. Okay. Next question. Question number nine. Here also, c1 by 2 plus c3 by 4 plus c5 by 6 plus So on till n terms. I think this question n terms is equals to how much? I think okay. Put n is equals to two. What will be happening while writing n is equals to two? What will be happening? Put n is equals to two. Question changes to. See next question. C one by two plus C three by four plus C five by six plus and so on. Okay, do observe that here not given any idea to take what is n value, but whichever you take n value, we have to consider the question till the terms exist. See till the terms exist means. Suppose put n is equals to three. Put n is equals to three c, till c three term exists. C three stands for n c three. That is three c three. 
C5 is MC5, 3C5, meaningless. That's why we have to write the question till the terms exist. Question changes to. Shall I write this is 3C1 by 2? This is 3C3 by 4. 3C1 is 3 by 2 plus 1 by 4. 7 by 4. Put n is equals to 3 in options also. Put n is equals to 3 in options. In options. First option, n value 3 means 2 power 4. 16 minus 1, 15 by 4. This is not our answer. Second option, 2 cube, 8 minus 1, 7 by 4. This is answer. Third option, 2 cube, 8 by 4. This is not our answer. Fourth option, 1 by 3 plus 1, 1 by 4. This is not our answer. Very simple. If you take n value 4, then also till 4c3 by 4 only we have to write. Because 4C5 does not exist. So that's why n is equals to 3. Next, 2 into C0 plus 2 square into C1 by 2 plus 2 cube into C2 by 3 plus 1 plus 2 power n plus 1 into Cn by n plus 1. There is an idea about the last term. Put n is equals to 2. Whenever n is equals to 2, the last term of the question will be 2 plus 1, 3. 2 cube into C2 by n plus 1. Wherever you are getting 2 cube into C2 by n plus 1. Till then we have to calculate the question. Or else n value 1 you take. 2 into. Shall I write directly 2 C0? However C0 is nothing but n C0. Plus 2 square into 2 C1 by 2. Plus 2 cube into. 2c2 by 3. Okay. This is 2 into 1 plus 4 into 2 by 2 plus 8 into 1 by 3. 2 to gets cancelled. 6 plus 8 by 3. 18 plus 8. 26 by 3. Search for option where you are getting 26 by 3. Put 10 is equals to 2 in options. First option, 1 by 3. No, this is ruled out. Second option, n value 2. 4 square is 16. I think this is n plus 1. 16 by 3. No. Third option, n value 2 means 3 cube is 27 minus 1. 26 by 3. Yes, this is answer. Fourth option, 4 cube 64 minus 1 63 by 3 which is 21 this is not our answer third option is our answer okay very simple substitution if you don't like n is equals to 2 go for n is equals to 3 that is your choice okay next question number 11 c naught square plus 3 into c1 square plus 5 into c2 square plus so on plus 2n plus 1 into cn square. Here also n is equals to anything. Better put n is equals to 2. While writing n is equals to. Why I am taking 2 means for n is equals to 1. There is a chance of getting more than one option correct. So that's why better to take n is equals to. If more than one option same then go to another substitution to avoid the second step of substitution first only i am taking n is equals to 2 for the sake of not going to second attempt put n is equals to 2 question changes to shall i write the question directly 2c not square plus 3 into 2c1 square if n is equals to, it stops at uh, c2 square plus 5 into 2c2 square. So last term will be 2 into 2, 4 plus 1, 5 into c2 square. Yes, this will be the last term. 2c0 is 1, 2c1 is 2, 2 square is 4 into 3, 12, 2c2 1 plus 5, 17 plus 1, 18, 
put n is equals to 2 in options in options first option n minus 2 is 0 ruled out case second option n minus 1 1 2n factorial 4 factorial by 2 factorial square 4 24 by 4 6 ruled out case third option n plus 2 4 2n factorial 4 factorial n factorial square 4 this is 24 ruled out case obviously fourth option answer this is 3 2n factorial 4 factorial by 4 this is 3 into 24 by 4 4 into 6 this is 18 fourth option is right answer so just by substitution we can evaluate without using the formula okay next problem c naught minus 2 square into c1 plus 3 square into c2 plus and so on plus minus 1 power n n plus 1 into 2 power n Look at the question number 12. C naught minus 2 square into C1 plus 3 square into C2 plus and so on minus 1 power n into n plus 1 whole square into Cn is equals to. Here also put n is equals to anything. Okay. If you write n is equals to 2, what will be happening? Lost term. While writing n is equals to 2, it becomes 2 plus 1, 3 square into c2 wherever you are getting two, 3 square into c2 till there we have to calculate put n is equals to 2 put n is equals to 2 ok question question 2c naught I am writing directly 2 square into 2c1 c1 stands for nc1 as I mentioned earlier plus 3 square into 2c2 2c naught is 1 minus 4 into 2 8 plus 9 however 2c2 is 1 9 plus 1 10 minus 8 2 we have to get 2 answer that's why put n is equals to 2 in options and search for 2 where you are getting First option 0, it does not depending upon n. Second option 2 square 4, it is not right answer. Third option 2 cube 8 minus 1, 7 by 3, ruled out case. Fourth option none of these, none of these is right answer.